Begin by removing and retaining the fasteners that secure the lower air dam to the front bumper. Remove the lower air dam from the front bumper. Remove the eight bolts that secure the center OEM bumper trim piece and remove the trim panel. Hold the boss bumper trim piece in place and mark the area on the bumper support to be trimmed. Use a grinder to carefully trim back the bumper support until the boss bumper trim piece fits properly. Verify boss bumper trim fitment. Remove the existing fasteners securing the tow hooks to the vehicle frame. Drop the bolt plate into the hole in the bottom of the frame rail. Slide the side plate over the frame rail and align it with the bolt plate and the tow hook holes. Loosely secure the bolt plate using a 5 8 inch lock washer and nut. Insert the two M12 bolts with washers through the side plate, frame rail, and tow hook. Loosely secure with M12 nylon lock nuts. Repeat the side plate install process on the other side. Remove the front plastic skid plate and mid-mounted metal skid plate. Using a 916 drill bit, drill out the threaded skid plate holes on the transmission cross member. Thread a half inch bolt and flat washer onto a bolt puller and insert it through the access hole in the top of the cross member through the previously drilled holes. Replace the rear skid plate by installing the rear bolts and aligning it over the previously installed half inch bolts. Attach the skid plate bracket using lock washers and full nuts. Loosely attach the push beam to the side plates using four half inch grade five bolts and nylon lock nuts on each side. Lower the vehicle to the ground and measure the push beam height from the floor to the center of the hook hole. Adjust the push beam as necessary to achieve a 15 and a half inch hook height. Attach the angle bracket to the push beam and skid plate bracket using half inch grade eight bolts and nylon lock nuts. Begin to tighten all fasteners on the undercarriage. These fasteners will receive final torque with a torque wrench. Torque the bottom 5 8 inch bolt of the side plates to 113 foot-pounds. Torque all half inch fasteners to 56 foot-pounds. Install the Boss Bumper Trim Kit, ensuring that the top lip of the trim kit catches the bumper. Use the OEM fasteners to secure the bottom of the trim kit to the bumper support plate. 